just starting off, I mean, uh, how was the send-off and how was the trip to, to Pittsburgh? Uh, it was good. You know, the guys are excited. We've, we've had a couple good days of practice, and uh, we'll get one more day of prep tomorrow uh, for Akron and then uh, throw it up in the air and see what happens on Thursday. Um, you, you said you'd be an expert on Akron by the end of Sunday night, so you must have, must have a Ph.D. at this point. Uh, what can you tell us about the Zips? I probably watched too much film, uh, but really impressed. I mean, defensively, they were the top team in the MAC, and I see why after watching a lot of games, they're very disciplined defensively and um, a lot of physicality. And then, you know, Freeman's was the player of the year in their league. He's, he's very talented in the paint, uh, elite shot blocker. And then Ali Ali, we played against at Butler last year, and he's had a heck of a year for him as well. So, uh, you know, we, it's a tough first round of opponents, especially out on the East Coast, but I'm confident our guys will be ready. Big day, accolades-wise, in terms of Baylor and Ryan receiving All-American honors. What was your reaction when you saw that? Yeah, I was happy. You know that all district teams came out, and, and Trey and Baylor and, and and Ryan were all on the all district teams. And then, uh, you know, for Baylor to to be named to one of the three teams and call, call an honorable mention is really credit uh, to their work ethic. Especially when you're on a team that plays so unselfishly, it's hard for. Uh, individual accolades sometimes when we move the ball the way that we do, uh, but you know, certainly happy for them and the things they've accomplished this season. Do you like having uh, a 130 tip off? I know it's probably better than a, you know, a 930 or 10 o'clock. I'll tell you at 330 <laughs> on Thursday <laughs> afternoon whether I liked it or not. Yeah, I mean, I, I think it's, it's difficult to sit around all day and wait in the anticipation uh, of a late game. So, you know, we've played plenty of noon or one o'clock games uh, in the Big East on Saturday, so our, our guys are accustomed to it. Um, we'll get up and play the game and see what happens. Coach, you told us you're a Steelers fan. You talk about it all the time. We know this is your first time. In <laughs> well, I, I just we just drove by the stadium. It was awesome, uh, surreal. So uh, someday when I retire, I'll get to one of those games. But uh, uh, cool to be in Pittsburgh, and, and you know, so far so good. Any sightseeing you can plan on, on fitting in in the midst of everything the, going on? Pretty much the inside of my room and a, and a computer screen. That'll be the that'll be the extent of my sightseeing. Um, lastly, for me, I know you made it to the second weekend plenty of times in your career you know just what does it take in terms of not looking ahead um, like is that the key to to advancing and getting past these few days absolutely you take it one game at a time obviously you know anybody that's in the tournament has had a heck of a year Akron's won 24 games uh, you know so they've had incredible success they've had a lot of close losses in their 10 losses so uh, you know everybody here is good you have to have your a game if you're not you're going to go home so um, you know, you really stay in the moment like we have all season long, and, you know, hopefully that can get us uh, through Thursday. Last question, Adam, what are you hoping the turnout looks like on Thursday for Blue Jay fans? Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, I've talked to a lot of people that are coming. Uh, I know a lot of people in Omar are excited, uh, you know, with D-Rock coming back as well. Uh, so I hope there's plenty of there to cheer him on as well. But, uh, you know, I think we'll have a good fouling, and, uh, you know, our, our fans have always showed up regardless of where we've gone, whether it's a – exempt event or the Big East tournament or NCAA play. I don't expect anything different this weekend.